Valentine's Day is only a couple days away, and the pressure is building for finding the perfect gift for your special someone. Time isn't always on your side, though, especially when we're scrambling for that perfect gift. So with that, today we have our comedian and podcast host of This Is For The Birds, Russ Williamson. Thank you. Thank you, Jordan. Appreciate it. All right, Russ. So I'm going to break it down. Valentine's Day, it's not one of my favorite holidays. Right. It brings more, you know, worry and stress more than anything. When you're supposed to be celebrating your lover, I wait till the last minute. I'm not going to lie to you. Can you help me out? It's a very commercial holiday, but what we're going to do is I, uh, I'm broke. Uh, <laughs> I know what you're saying, Russ. What are you talking about? You're on the jam. You're, you're killing it right now. <laughs> Uh, listen, I don't have a lot of money, so what I did was just get some stuff around the house okay. to make your Valentine's Day uh, uh, special. Let's start to and the right, right yeah. here. We got a DVD. Listen. One of my favorite movies, one of the best of all time. You got DVDs around the house, grab a DVD, pop it in, you have a movie night. This right here, coming to America, it's very apropos for today's times. Uh, 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 an immigrant coming from a faraway land, making uh, a name for himself in yeah, America. Living the American dream. Yeah. Put your hands together for Mr. Randy Watts. Yes. <laughs> yes. Oh, <boy>, good. <laughs> And Arsenio Hall was there too. Yes. Uh, and also now you could uh, you find some stuff in your in your pantry. Make some uh, cookies or some brownies. If you're feeling a little crazy, put a little weed in. Okay, huh? I figured it huh? might be going that way. What? Turn the date up a little bit. Yes. You might want to let your date know, because then you can get into some trouble. No, don't let her know. Okay. It'll be fun. <laughs> It'll be fun, but just uh, keep them away from the kids, all right? That's where you draw the line. Yes. Don't, no kids. Or, you know, give them one, and then they go to bed early, and then uh, you guys have the house to yourself, huh? <laughs> okay, so we've got a good DVD. We've got our brownies. Right. <laughs> what up? And you gotta mix right. it up with some brew, yeah, obviously. You gotta have a little old style, uh, some champagne. Oh, we're gonna get it going here. Whatever you need. Hey, it's seven in the morning. <laughs> this thing's going off the rails, ladies and gentlemen. How's it taste? <laughs> it's warm. Right? Yeah, have some. <laughs> oh. Oh. That was good. Oh, you stop it. That, uh, is, that is warm. <laughs> this is like a Valentine's Day date. Right. It just became one here. Now, that's uh, really after warm, the old Russ. style, if you got to go. This date's not going well so far. <laughs> I'm not going to lie to you. If you have to drive somewhere, uh, you don't want the cops knowing you just had an old style. Pop in some gum, and you're ready to go. If you have to pick up the kids or something, <laughs> have a brownie, pound an old style, take some gum. Okay. Now. Okay, toilet paper's gonna, next. I'm nervous. You see this toilet paper sitting here, you're like, what? What are we gonna do it's with this? Put a heart on it, though. You can put a heart on it and, and put them on all the bathrooms, so you know, that's a nice little touch. Or what you could do, after the special brownies, after the old style, go to one of your ex's house and just start toilet papering the place. You know? <laughs> toilet paper, light a bag of dog duty on fire, whatever you want. Just make sure you do it together as a couple. There you go. That, nothing says love. Then finally, are we lighting a candle for something? We are doing some Is this candles? actually romantic? Oh, last listen, part here? listen. When she comes home, you want to make that house look like a boys to men video, okay? <laughs> All right? Like, Throw your clothes on the floor. I'm going to take my clothes off now. Right? Keep it going. <laughs> I don't make love to you <laughs> like you want <laughs> Oh, and we're still yeah, we're here. Yeah, we're all over the place and have fun. But uh, make sure that you uh, treat a special this Valentine or your partner, anybody. Hey, listen, 2018. I don't care. Whoever you are spending Valentine's Day with, treat her right. Russ, I see you got a ring on your finger. That is a very brave hey, woman. You don't get you don't get one of these without killing Valentine's Day every year. <laughs> Amen, brother. That's what he does, everybody. Thank you, Russ. To hear more from Russ Williamson, check out his podcast. This is for the birds. I'm thinking there might be some even better advice on there, too.